Hi Kindred family, Pastor Jason here to give you a quick update of what we have planned this weekend. We hope that as we approach the end of the week, each of you are living in light of what Paul commends the Galatians in Galatians chapter 5 verse 25 to walk and keep in step with the Spirit. This Sunday morning, Pastor Philip will be preaching out of Ruth chapter 4 as we move towards the close of our study in this book. I don't know about you, but I've been completely blown away and blessed, uh, really even challenged by the depth of what we found in this short and impactful book. So you don't want to miss out as our pastor preaches the final verses of Ruth chapter 4. We'll also be taking communion together this Sunday. We saw a great number of you out in our tent services this past week as we practiced one ordinance with baptism. This week we'll be practicing the other ordinance the Lord gave us as we celebrate the Lord's table together. We hope that you'll join us. As has been our pattern in recent Sundays, our services are at 8 a.m. and 9.45 a.m. And remember, we're happy for you to dress comfortably to help beat the heat. We'll also have water bottles available outside of both tents. Then on Sunday evening, we'd love to have you come back out and join us at 6 p.m. in the tent for a live service as we conclude our series, A Christian Mind in the Age of Technology. We've already been blessed by the teaching of Dr. Sam Horn from the Master's Seminary and University and our very own Pastor Philip. And this week, we have the wonderful privilege of having Austin Duncan come and teach on this important topic. Austin has been a friend of Kindred for many years. He's currently a staff pastor at Grace Community Church, focusing on college ministry. And he's gonna center his message on how technology impacts our relationships. Uh, this is an especially important message for the youth, the young adults, and the parents of our church, but really it's impactful for all of us. And so we hope you'll join us. After the service, we'll have fellowship and ice cream bars on the patio. On behalf of our pastoral staff and our elders, I wanna let you know how grateful we are for each of you. We consider it a privilege to serve you, and if there's anything we can do for you, please don't hesitate to contact us through our office or our media platforms. God bless you, and I'm looking forward to seeing many of you on Sunday.